But not all of Marauders finished last year 14-8 and eight, and third in the American division. An influx of great and promising talent from the feeder program has the team excited for the upcoming year. For head coach Sean Smythe entering his 16th year, expectations can usually bring about some slacking. However, this squad has been working hard and has been showing him it has the talent and desire to go far. Yeah, absolutely. A young squad, very talented. Uh, I'd say a hard-working squad. Uh, these guys are definitely wrestling kids. Uh, they're all about the sport. They like coming in. They're, they're, they're self-motivated. Um, you know, they have goals and they have objectives, and uh, they know how to get them. And, uh, you know, the off-season work that they've done, I think, is going to you know, have a lot of success for us during the season this year. One wrestler the Marauders can rely on is Shane Murphy. The senior has noticed a change in the pace of practice and their preparation for the upcoming season. Uh, we're really uh, working hard, practicing hard, uh, running every day. Um, the pace in the room is uh, set pretty high. We have uh, Coach Ryerson and I kind of changed the pace. We're moving a lot harder. This the Mount Olive Marauders are a very good team, and I expect them to be successful on the mat. With a nice influx of youth from the feeder program that should continue for the next few years, I see this as a program that's going to be scary good over the next few seasons. I think this team will be very successful this year, finish above 500, and qualify for the state sectional tournament. However, in a stacked American division, I look for them to finish fourth. For GardenStateHSWrestling.com, Donald J. Brower, reporting.